Well, the truth is this. You know, we are all servants. We are serving, the, we are serving Nigerians. As far as I'm concerned, the Honorable Attorney General Federation has spoken on this matter, and the President has sealed the whole of the issues this morning in his broadcast. And I think I can only just appeal to Nigerians, let's allow this policy to work. Um, this policy is one policy that goes to solve the problem of reducing corruption and illicit financial flows. This policy goes to resolve some of the problems in the economy. This policy also goes to re reducing the level of insecurity in the country. So these three issues, which are <clears throat> the tripod of this administration's policy, are all embedded in this policy. We should just allow it to work. We keep saying this. There are some tra uh, temporary pains, but I can assure Nigerians that the long-run benefit to Nigeria is overwhelming, and we should just give it a chance to work. So what should we expect from the CBN following the pres <clears throat> presidential directives? The president has given his directives. I have met with about 15 banks this morning, later, and we've given them directives about how they should make all the old 200 Naira notes available, effective today. And I can assure Nigerians that it, this will help to reduce the pains. We meet with the bankers at least once daily to get feedback and the rest of them. And I think we should just allow this policy work. The pains, temporary pains are regrettable, but I can assure Nigerians that it will be well. Thank you. Thank you.